Well, whether it was an intended consequence or not, Obamacare is about to save Albany County hundreds of thousands of dollars. The sheriff says he's enrolling dozens of inmates into a health plan before their sentence because then it becomes the federal government's problem to pay for any health care that they receive. Our Pat Bailey joins us live now to tell us more. It sounds intriguing, Pat. Well, Liz, he promises to save taxpayers money. Albany County Sheriff Craig Apple told me the county is, in fact, on the hook for all sentenced inmates if they need medical care. He says by enrolling them into the Affordable Health Care Act, it will save county taxpayers money and very quickly. Now, Apple says last year alone, 65 inmates were admitted to the hospital. Of those, he says all but nine were sentenced. And because they were not, that makes them eligible for the so-called Obamacare. If the projected number of inmates Apple thinks will register do, he says the county would save a minimum $250,000 next year. Apple says taxpayers will be on the hook no matter what either at the county or federal level, so they should save money where they can. Whether you believe in the Affordable Health Care Act or not is really irrelevant in, in my view because what we're trying to do is basically take the burden off, the, off of Albany County. And it's here. We might as well take advantage of it. Now, the program works this way. If an inmate signs up for the Affordable Health Care Act, they will be covered while in jail. When they leave, if they can afford the insurance plan, that they will, they will stay on that insurance plan. If not, they will fall back into the Medicaid system. Now, Sheriff Apple says Albany County taxpayers pay many taxes, obviously county, state, and federal, but this program helps to alleviate at least one of them. Now, of the current inmate population, Apple says 50 have enrolled, and another, get this, 400 are eligible. Coming up tonight at 5 and 6 o'clock, actually, we're headed over to the Albany, County, uh, the Albany County Jail right now to talk to some inmates who are signing up, we're told, Liz, in this program as we speak. We'll have more at 5 and 6.